Hello and welcome to another LSPEC training video. In this video, we will explore the powerful event source detection feature of events from DIP and interruption types, shedding light on their origins within your power system. PQ SCADA is equipped with a unique capability to recognize event sources, categorizing them into three distinct classifications. Upstream represent events originated from an extern external network, like your uh, electricity supplier. Downstream represents events stemming from an internal network, like your own wiring. Unknown marks event where the source couldn't be identified. This crucial information is displayed as a column within the event chart available under both the investigation and power quality modules within PQ SCADA. Starting from uh, Sapphire version 107.28, PQ SCADA can identify the source of power quality event. Now, when you create an a new event chart, all the PQ events will be displayed but our spotlight will be on the events like dip and interruption. The best part, PQ SCADA will sort out where these events are coming from. It will label them as upstream, downstream, or unknown in the event source column for each PQ event. Same for power quality module. Events However, for historical events that were inserted to Sapphire before version 107.28, users can activate the event, the event source detection feature within the schedule module. Here's, this is the schedule module. Here, how you can do it. Navigate to the schedule module within the PQ SCADA Sapphire. Click on the option to create new task. Choose the control and maintenance option and proceed by clicking the next button. Select the event source detection from the available options and proceed to the next step. Insert a valid name for the task. Press the next. Select run type and press the next button. Select the time interval for the task to run and process the historical data. Here is the start time of the data time interval and the end time. Here, when the task will run, task running time. Then press the next button. Choose the relevant component for which you want to detect the event sources. Press next. Move the specific event type, in our uh, case, dip and interruption, from the source to the destination, and then press the next button. Once configured, click finish to conclude the task setup. Once the steps are completed, you can create an event chart based on specific time interval you use to visualize and analyze the event sources detected by PQ SCADA for the selected component. Thank you for watching. Be sure to like us on Facebook, connect with us on LinkedIn, and subscribe to our YouTube channel. Have a great day.